Howdy Harpers, it's Terry again, and got a really good treat, really special find. Uh, we had a, a fur lance brought to us today. This is Bothrop's Asper uh, in Costa Rica, and the scientific name, Bothrop's Asper. The local name here, they call this snake uh, terciopelo, which means velvet skin, because of the, the sort of texture and the appearance of this snake skin. It's very smooth, very nice. You can see this uh, beautiful pattern there. And this snake is uh, basically the most dangerous snake in Central and South America. Uh, it's, it's a pit viper, much like uh, the eyelash viper and the bushmaster. And although other snakes may have more potent venom, this snake, with its abundance, um, and people, uh, especially farmers and whatnot, stepping on them or, or running into them, this snake is responsible for the majority of snake bites in Central South America and the, the majority of fatalities as well. And it's a, it's a really cool animal and it's just um, uh, kind of true to form today. We were brought, this snake, we were brought by a farmer. We were walking the beach earlier and uh, he stopped us and said that he had killed one before. He was clearing a pasture for his, uh, for his cows. And he said that he had killed one before. It was a gorgeous snake. It was a little bit bigger than this. It was a female. And we told him, we said, if you find any more, let us know. We'll remove them from your property. Well, that a this afternoon, he showed up with a rice sack, and this is what was inside. So we were really fortunate that he didn't kill it and that he brought it to us. And so you can see, really, really nice animal. This snake actually, um, the tail is all black now. When they're juveniles, they use that to caught a lure, they'll wiggle that like a worm. Um, but it'd be a, a brighter color, like a yellow or an orange. It's a very nice, very nice pattern. Gorgeous vertical pupil there. And you can see the triangular shaped head, characteristic of pit vipers. And you can see I'm using this tube. It's a, a safer way to handle venomous snakes and it allows us to get our measurements and our data off of them without stressing the snake by holding it behind the head um, or putting ourselves in danger. So, Costa Rica has been good to us and uh, this is a good example of that. So I hope you like it and I'll see you next time.